Hi everybody, thank you so much for joining me today. I'm gonna be doing an all drugstore Thanksgiving eyeshadow tutorial. I'm gonna be using the Rimmel Magnifies Spice Edition eyeshadow palette. I've been wanting to use this for quite some time because it is a really, really pretty palette. It reminds me a lot of the Naked Heat palette. So let's just jump right in. I'm starting off with this shade here. This is my transition color. And I'm taking this in the crease and I'm also blending it on the outer portion of my lid and also the inner portion as well because I am doing a halo look I feel like you can't go wrong with a halo look it's a little more I don't know fancier than like a regular eyeshadow look and it's really pretty I feel like it makes my eyes look bigger than normal I mean my eyes aren't big at all but I feel like it makes them look a little bit more big and then I'm going into this orangey color I think this one's super pretty and look at this pigmentation it is really good don't get me wrong, this isn't like the most pigmented eyeshadow palette ever, but for being at the drugstore, this is great. Um, Wet n Wild eyeshadows and Rimmel eyeshadows are my favorite. You can't go wrong. And they have a ton of different versions of these like magnifies eyeshadow palettes. Um, I know they have a blush one, uh, like a jewel toned one. So you guys should definitely check them out if you're interested. They're really good palettes. So I just put that shade in the inner portion and outer portion and then I'm taking this kind of like deeper orangey brown and doing pretty much the same thing but with a smaller brush. This is like a small domed brush, putting that in the outer V, in the crease, in the inner corner. So I want you guys to tell me what your favorite Thanksgiving food is. Mine, hands down, I have two, I can't pick between the two. Um, broccoli casserole that my mom makes, it's delicious. And then number two, basic standard stuffing. Stuffing is so freaking good. Am I right? Am I wrong? What do you guys think? I'm totally right, because I don't know, stuffing is just so good. So here I took um, a little bit of concealer. This is the Maybelline Instant Age Rewind. And then of course, I don't know what's wrong with me, I forgot to refocus my camera which is weird because I'm usually on top of that um, I don't know I don't know what was going on in my head so I took that orangey shimmer put that on first and then I layered the lightest shade in that palette right on top I blended all of that out and then here we are again with the concealer um, I'm doing my regular concealer routine cleaning up my eyeshadow edge covering my under eye circles and then we are good I used the Maybelline Fit Me Loose Powder today, guys. I hate that powder so much. I know a lot of people like it, but for me, it's horrible. Oh, I skipped a step. <laughs> I decided to do eyeliner. I don't know, I'm, I've been in like a little eyeliner kick recently. So I use the Physician's Formula 2-in-1 Eye Booster Eyeliner. And then of course I always clean up my edge, guys. So don't forget to clean up that edge. Here we go with the Fit Me powder. It looks good when I first apply it, but then within minutes, it just looks like I'm 80 years old underneath my eyes. It's so bad. Here I am lining my lower lash line with the darkest shade that I used, and then I'm blending that out with the transition color that I used. And then after that, I'm gonna put on some false lashes. These are by Kiss. These are the Naked, what is it called? The Naked Drama in Chiffon. These were gorgeous. I love these. I want to use these like every single day. So this concludes this super easy drugstore eyeshadow tutorial. It's perfect for Thanksgiving, but really guys, you can use this whenever you want. It's up to you. Check out those Rimmel palettes and don't forget, shop your stash, go through your makeup before you go out and buy, you know, new makeup. Let's, let's use what we have. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you in my next video. Bye.